Hello there and welcome back to another episode in our Father's Frontier series. So, this uh, should be pretty much the last episode I think, because the only thing we had left to do was to upgrade to the next tier, and there's a couple of more buildings that we do want to construct here as well, so... Oh, someone is being upgraded, so that's good. And uh, yeah, so I've kind of had a look around what we are missing, so one of those things was the apothecary shop over here to produce some uh, medicine for our citizens and um, whilst we are going into this winter why don't we start upgrading the town hall already so yes the game has run for enough time for us to pile up some money but also have the citizens required to start this upgrade okay so we are going to require 250 bricks 5000 gold and uh, 100 iron and 150 wood planks so yeah let's queue it up right now since we have quite a large population um, 120 of them are laborers which is wonderful means things are getting moved around pretty quickly and we should have enough builders as well so yeah things seem pretty pretty good okay now another thing we do want to do is let's have a look over here I think I did another field somewhere as well oh that's this one yep so that's uh, going in there I have increased uh, the number of people that work in the sand pit over here. We just need a, quite, a, quite a bit of sand. And I was looking in this area as well. There's quite a few resources that are nearby. And since we have so many people that work for us, why don't we build a couple of forager shacks over here? So that's one, that's two. Okay, one over here. And I'm guessing the other one could sort of harvest the resources around this area. And I think we would like to also explore a little bit. Now that we do have enough people, uh, we can send them around and just have a look what's behind those hills over there. Okay, fantastic. So next thing, this field is now operational and producing us some resources as well, which is great. And the second one, food was obviously a bit of a struggle so the apple trees are starting to grow up as well so maturity is now at 37 percent which is pretty good last year we produced about 250 so that's definitely picking up what about you 125 only oh that's because you have some younger trees there as well all right cool now the next thing uh, let's have a look at our resources as well so it comes to food uh right right, right. milk we have quite a bit cheese Hmm, okay, tons of milk actually. Not a lot of cheese. Why don't we take a look over here? Alright, we can do a few more workers over here. Beautiful, why don't you jump there? And now since our population and the town is growing pretty nicely as well, we should start upgrading some of those towers. I've done one over here already. And uh, we don't have to upgrade them all, but I do feel that a few of them would definitely benefit us. Now the... What we get by upgrading them. Oh, that's quite a few notifications over there. Okay, so let's take a look. We get an increased durability, which of course is great. Additional range damage as well, and also the increased attack range. So yeah, that's um, that's all pretty good. Now let's have a look over here. We've got a bit of a gap, and we wanted to do another barracks, but so far we haven't really needed it. So I'm not entirely sure if we should build another one. Yeah, okay, so... I guess we'll decide. Let's see if there's another massive raid that comes in. And... Oh, there's no trees around this area. Okay, well, that's okay. Let's place you over there. Yeah, so if there is a massive raid coming in that we cannot handle, then that's when we shall build perhaps another barracks as well and have some more warriors in our town to help us out. All right, what's your problem? Uh, you can do another person here. Why not? Okay. So another thing we have changed around, it's just a minor thing really, was we had a few production buildings over here, such as the tannery, the hunter, and the work work camp over here. So we have kind of moved them out of the way a little bit. And uh, since there aren't a ton of trees over here, I've sort of started to plant a few extra ones as well. Yeah, there's not a lot there indeed. And, uh, oh, why don't we apply the compost as well? Let's have a look. This one could use some. And what about you? There's one really far away from us. 
right there we go and let's apply to one of those newer fields over here as well beautiful 25 and we're almost done with this why don't we give you a priority get it done quickly ah there we go beautiful so uh, yeah bit of work is queued up on this field already weeds are 42 and rockiness pretty low so i think it should be done soon right so we'll let them work on this field for a, a little while and after this year before the winter what we shall do is expand this field to this whole zone i'm pretty sure we can right okay so that's from here and oh yeah beautiful so that's gonna be another massive field now one thing i was thinking oh wait a second these can be upgraded hold on are we tier four now oh yes we are well you look at that waffle socket is finally tier four that is beautiful to see let me just slow down the time and have a look what else can we upgrade around this area uh right 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 no not a lot over here oh the barracks can be upgraded as well what does that give us additional work is durability range damage and the range as well yeah so 500 gold iron we have everything gold is a little low of course and we don't have a ton over here but we do have another merchant and what are you purchasing clothes that's good and uh, we are mining quite a bit of clay so yeah why don't we sell some of it i think we can do quite a bit okay so let's transfer you over uh everything else no i don't think we really want to sell the iron just yet still producing a few uh cheese would be lovely to buy that's gonna take all of our money but it sells for a pretty good price. Okay, so that probably means we are going to sell all the clothes as well. And we might even do a bit of iron because we do have a little bit in stock over here. Alright, there we go. Uh, okay, moving on. Let's have a look what else do we want to do. There's one of the stockyards over here that we can upgrade, but we don't have a ton of resources. Okay, now it seems a few of those people have expired, so yeah, let's put another... Oh, there we go. 107 readers. I believe that's the biggest we've seen in this playthrough, so why don't we ring the alarm. Alright, where are you guys coming from? From this side. Okay. So, these towers, oh, we haven't upgraded any of you just yet. You are upgraded, which is great. Could use another worker in some of them as well. Oh yeah, they're all empty. Okay, I think that should be enough. And now let's speed up the time a little bit. Oh, it's a lord. Okay, 12 months to pay 2,000 gold. We don't have it. So why don't we see what happens if we deny? Yep, that's a massive force. And they're all coming from this side. Oh dear. Okay. Let's see what happens. Right. We might have to recruit a few more people in some of these buildings. I hope we have enough time. Okay, you're full. Let's do another one here. And here they come. Okay. Okay. Wow, that's not very nice of you to destroy these fences over here. I mean, they're not really defensive structures, are they? Okay, one second. Bit of a lag over there, it seems. So we'll slow it down to this level. Okay, so that tower's definitely gonna go. Let's see, only one of them working there. Oh, wow, yeah, that's a... That's a lot of warriors, but I'm kind of glad they piling to the middle yeah this is way better okay get back in there really hope you have two. Oh no you don't okay quickly grab some weapons jump in the tower what about these ones okay you've got two you've got two we're pretty good over here and that's sorted as well 
and beautiful. Some of them are already moving to the other side as well. Oh, okay. Well, before it gets too crazy, let's uh, quickly have a look at the other trader as well before he leaves. Ah, shame we can't buy those linen clothes from you. Uh, what else do we have? Oh, no, cheese is pretty cheap right now. That's a shame. Uh, don't think we need to buy any grains. Everything else is kind of meh as well. Yeah, don't really want this stuff. Lower prices, but we could sell some. Why don't we transfer a few for the sale? Okay, everything else is pretty low, so we don't want it. You still have a bit of money as well. Okay, here goes the... Or the clay. And now let's enjoy the battle. Alright, few of them are down. Oh wow, okay. Is that all their forces? Are they not coming from somewhere else? Oh yes, there we go. They've already broke through the gates over there, or the walls. But not a lot of warriors. That is good. Let's have a look over here. Who's the... Uh, must be a hunter. Okay. Yeah, I think we should be fine. I mean, there is a lot of them here. Yeah, a lot. But I think we are getting rid of them pretty pretty quickly. And with the barracks, the barracks are supporting us pretty nicely there as well. I do feel that, yeah, maybe upgrading the barracks would be quite lovely. And perhaps another tower as well. Oh no, they're almost through the gates over here. Or the, the walls, I mean. Now, why aren't you shooting at these guys? And now you've decided to run out as well for some reason. Not really sure why. Alright, we'll see where they are heading. Uh, wait a second, we've lost a few more cards. Okay, there you go. Oh wow, that's a lot of people that have expired, unfortunately. Miners. Okay, there we go. A couple more farmers as well. And definitely you guys. Okay, there we go. I think there was something else. Tanner, there we go. Okay. Oh dear. They are through now. And I don't want to lose the barracks. So hopefully they can go and deal with them. Where are you guys? Come on, get over there. Start hitting them. And same with you as well. If you could please make your way there. Right. No, all of you guys. Hit the ones that are destroying the barracks, please. Oh wow, they have pushed through all the gates. And the last one is about to drop as well. So yeah, it seems the Lord's army is a little bit... No, wrong button. Is a little bit stronger. And I really hope... Okay, so you might want to fall back a little bit. But everyone else that is still alive... Could use a bit of backup over there. Yep, same with you as well. Please head that way. Okay, seems they are... Running off now, which is great. Oh, wow. Okay, let's highlight everything as well and mark you down for rebuilding. Well, at least we didn't lose any towers, not the barracks, but I do feel that we are going to need a, another wall around here, or an additional layer, perhaps. Okay, and same over here, everything seems to be pretty fine. So yes, I am a little bit surprised we managed to hold them back. And uh, with a few upgrades over here, expanding the wall as well, I think we should be good, yeah. Oh dear, that's all our laborers gone, it seems. And I think that's probably because we... Oh, we lost like 40 people. Pretty sure we had like 430 before. Uh, let's have a look. Was there another trader? Oh wow, everything sells for 
such a low price. Wait a second. 14. Oh, I see. Okay, no, everything's fine. Anything else we want to purchase? Well, the only thing is probably those linen clothes over here. So yeah, why don't we spend like 3,000. Off you go. Okay, so when it comes to upgrades, let's speed up the time one more time. Alright. And, okay. Pretty sure we're producing some more bricks now as well, which is great. Yeah, so the defenses will go up very... Very shortly again. Can we try and grab this flag? Return to barracks. Here you go. Alright, so compost time. Let's have a look. One of those fields... Oh no. Okay, we've already done these ones. That's okay. That's a ton of people that died on this road, unfortunately. Uh, yeah, let's put compost over there then. Uh, right, right, right. Lots of fences that need repairing as well. Rebuild it all. Let's have a look over there. Same thing it appears. And what about this section? I'm sure there's a couple left. Oh no, okay. Everything's being fixed or fixed already. Village raided. Right, so 107 attacked us. We destroyed 79 of them. We did lose 39 people though. And that's not very good. It seems because they came from this angle over here, or from that side, a lot of those um, farmers and other people that work for us kind of got stuck over here, didn't have enough time to run towards safety. But it also seems that uh, once we activate... Oh, should probably deactivate this now. Yeah, once we activate it, uh, everything that's like really far from us or people that are working in some of those remote areas they don't really care about it, and they continue with their daily business. Yeah. Okay, so you guys are ready as well. Why don't we give you... You can cover everything on that side, which is great. And what about you? Oh, there's a ton of stuff over here. Or maybe even... Let's have a look. Okay, we can get some more medicine. That's great. Uh, yeah, let's do this. Few people have died here, though. Which makes me wonder... Do we have wolves somewhere here? No. Okay, that's a little odd, but maybe maybe they were just a little bit too old. Who knows? Cool. Okay, so... You guys are... Okay, you're running off now as well. Great. And seems we have forgotten to connect this road, so there you go. Right, so why don't we look at some of the other upgrades that we would like to do. Oh no, we are very low on bricks now. Let's have a look. So 30 laborers now, which is good. Forger, there we go. Right, I'm pretty sure we were producing bricks around somewhere here. Not these ones. They're the same, isn't it? No, you are producing iron for us. Okay, Fletcher, Weaver, Soap. Oh dear, where is it? Ah, Brickyard. Okay, there we go. Only four people in here, but... Hmm. 90 per year. We might be fine, and if we have to, we can purchase some bricks as well, obviously. But for the time being, yeah, let's uh, take a look at... Wait, there's something else that's paused over here. That's the glass maker, which means we are probably... Oh yeah, we got tons of glass. Uh, you're full, and medicine, why don't we check you as well? Okay, wonderful. Right, so the next thing we do... Right, so the next thing we do want to check is... What are some of the new buildings that we do have access to now? Oh, wait a second. Do we have a cooper already, or do we not... If we don't have one, I would very much love to place you. Uh, Space-wise, okay, why don't we place you over here for the time being. Okay, so that's one of them. Food production, that's all tier 3 as well. Uh, cheese maker we have... Oh, we might not have you. Okay, 
not to worry. Not a ton of space in here, but why don't we place you here? Oh, you're gonna require quite a few bricks as well. Okay, fine. What about tier 3? We have the Glassmaker Furniture Workshop. Actually, we don't have you. So we can do... Yeah, let's place you just like so. Okay, so now why don't we speed you up as well. Three times the speed. And um, yeah, blanks and bricks are low, but we'll give it some time. We have a full station or a full house. Cutting all that wood into planks and uh, logs wise, we're doing pretty pretty nicely so far as well. Okay, now you are... Actually, that's very easy. Let's just move it a little bit. Okay, there we go. Now, <laughs> resource wise, everything's good. Right, so it seems there isn't really anything new. Well, the fences, yeah. Could pretty up the colony if we wanted to. But it doesn't really... I don't really see how we benefit from that. Other than making it look a bit nicer. So yeah, it seems there's no new buildings in tier 4. At least right now on this uh, branch. And um, we just got a few upgrades though. So it's the barracks. And that requires a ton of bricks as well. Right. 37 laborers right now. I do feel that making another brick maker would probably be wise. Now what do you require to be constructed? Let's have a look. Some <laughs> oh blanks I see. And everything else we have. Okay, cool. So why don't we place you a little further away from the houses since they don't really like being near. I guess here is fine as well. Alright, there we go. And if we want to speed up our blanks production, which I don't think we really need to, but we could. But right now we just want to get those laborer numbers up as well, so why don't we bring you down. I don't think we need that many construction workers anymore. And 20 should be fine, right? Yeah. Alright, here we go. That's another year. And we did say we do want to upgrade a few more towers. Right, we are going to require blanks, which we don't have. However, uh, let's see how these buildings are going. Right, the Cooper is now ready. I'm a little bit surprised. I think, I'm pretty sure we have it somewhere. No, not in this area. What's in the back over there? That's the firewood splitter. Can little shop baskets. Okay, so maybe we didn't build you. Well, that's fine. At least we got one now. And uh, you use up oh, blanks as well. Okay. I see. Yeah, so we might have to start producing a few more blanks. All right, right, right. Let's, uh, yep, yeah, sure. Why not? Let's grab you. And, wow, you have to be pretty far from the houses. So, okay, we'll place you here. Let's give you a slightly higher priority as well. And I would like to start upgrading, especially the towers next to the gates, but, yeah. I'm just a little worried that what if there's another raid and you are no longer functional. Okay, let's take a look. How many bricks did you need again? About a hundred, wasn't it? Oh yeah. Okay, well, what we'll do is we'll upgrade the rest. And uh, once you are done, we can start gathering and piling up our bricks as well. Oh dear, what's happening over there? Was that a wolf or a hunter? Oh no, it's someone's shooting from here. Who is it? Hold on a second. You're a miner. Interesting. So let's take a look at the sails with this here as well. Right, so there's a couple of you. Let's slow down the time. Okay, we can do some pottery. It's not the best of the prices, but it's also not too bad. 
Anything else we need to buy? No, pretty expensive and we don't have a lot of money right now. What about Trader 2? Uh, right, medicine is pretty decent. Tools for 28 and you are selling tools. Okay, how much money do you have? Lots of money. Right, so that's what we are going to do. Uh, buy and stock. Here we go. Oh no. You're only selling them, not buying them. Well, that was a bit of a mistake. And now we have to sell something. What are we... Yeah, let's do a bit of medicine. At least we get some of the money back. And I think water is going to go as well. Alright, we'll do... Let's say... This should be enough. Cool. Happy days. Uh, so, right, 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 yeah. So, I think everything else we're pretty much sorted. I mean, there isn't really anything else to build. And to continue from here, it's really about just making things, you know, expanding. But right now, once you've constructed everything, it just feels like there's no massive need to do anything else unless you just want to fill the map and you know make it a bit more prettier in a way but then again as you expand your colony as well the larger your population the more it's gonna hit your frames so so yeah i think um uh, i think we can save we're pretty happy with the production so far what i'll do now is i'll let the game run for a little bit and let's do another raid because these are always quite fun to watch as well Okay, it seems we didn't have to wait for too long. There is already a raid incoming. And uh, yeah, all I managed to do was just uh, make a few sales and I already noticed that. Here we go. Right, so let's uh, ring the alarm bells. Don't suppose we can upgrade any of our towers, but we'll add a, another staff member over there. And uh, yeah, this one's definitely smaller. There's only 82 of them attacking, and I don't think it's a lord. So, I'm assuming... Where are you guys? Oh, I see. I see what's happening. That's not very nice. We'll mark it down for rebuilding. Why are you running over there? I must have been chasing someone. Alright. Here we go. Hopefully our villagers have enough time to run towards safety. And yeah, it is really annoying when they destroy those fences. I mean, I don't really want to place them in the colony. But, oh well, it is what it is. Alright, here we go. Let me just speed you up a little bit as well. And yeah, if they attack from the middle, I think we should be pretty fine. Here we go. Here's some of the first of the raiders that have arrived. And if they just arrive here one by one, then uh, yeah, they definitely won't last very long. All right, we're already starting to lose our food as well. Well, that's okay. Let's move back over. You guys, oh dear. Okay, you've taken down all of this already. Rebuild this. What was this over here? Firewood splitter. Okay, fine. Right, right, right. Where's everyone? This, this can't be all of the raiders. There must be more. Oh, okay, here we go. There's, uh, there's a few spare, spare ones arriving now. And uh, yeah, that's most definitely one of the easiest ways to defend, actually, because it seems they just got distracted with some other stuff. All right, there we go. And I think we're pretty much done now. Okay, there's another brave one. And you guys were trying to break into this tower. So yeah, that was actually a pretty good distraction over here. It means um, the ones that couldn't attack those gates over here started advancing towards our colony and yeah that kept, kept us nice and safe as well but okay so um yeah i'm uh, i've noticed there have been some updates but they were more like minor 
uh, something that was pretty great to see was the performance uh, update that the developers pushed through not too long ago. And I did also read about some of the sort of early ideas for some new buildings and mines and stuff as well, which would be would be great to see, especially for like mining rocks from the mountains. Um, but yeah, now what we'll do is we'll um, we'll just wait for some some new updates for the game. And since this wasn't actually the uh, hardest of maps, I think it would be pretty cool to do a playthrough on one of the harder maps as well. But yeah, let's uh, let's see how it goes. In the meanwhile, thank you so much for following this series. I definitely had a lot of fun building this colony, relocating everything, and uh, we, we surely learned a lot throughout this playthrough as well. So once again, thank you so much for watching. Hope you enjoyed and see you soon.